I'm Hal O'Connor. I've been chair of the Columbarium Committee here since we started to plan it back in 2001. And we uh, had our first interment in 2004. And we eventually will have nine units here. And each one of them uh, has 96 companion niches in it. Companion meaning they hold two urns in each niche. We handle all of the sales ourselves, and our inscriptions are included in the sales price, which is $4,000 for a niche. And that includes the inscription. Since there's two urns, it's two inscriptions. And we also include in the fee a proportional amount from each niche sale going toward the purchase of our next unit. Originally, when we were searching for a firm that would build the columbarium units, we visited a number of churches where there were columbaria before we selected Eikhoff, which seemed to us to have the kind of units that we wanted. These units are located in what we call our prayer garden outside, and there's various phases to it, such as a pond that we put in, and then we have a memorial for our unborn children over there. So all of this was part of the original planning. The overall design of the, the whole area, the prayer garden and the columbarium units has been very well received. We do have uh, the a funeral in the church and then uh, we process down from the church into the columbarium here and the regular Catholic burial service is conducted here. Well, it's very convenient to walk down from the church. It, uh, the procession only takes uh, several minutes, actually. And oftentimes, then, the family and other guests go back inside to the church where they'll have a reception following it. So it is convenient to have the, the columbarium right next to the church because a lot of people come here and pray here, and they like to be near where their loved ones are interred. And it's a very peaceful and quiet place, as you can tell. York was the first unit, and then we designed it so that uh, the other radius units go around, and yet there's area of grass in the center. And uh, we often have 25, 50 people at an interment, so there's plenty of area for people to stand. And when the first unit came, Eikhoff, uh, this was all one unit. Otherwise, the, the radius units are sort of set up on the site. But this was one unit and we lowered it in by crane and set it right on the location. So it's, it's pretty quick and clean. It comes in by a truck, of course. As I say, the rest of the units, other than the New York unit, they're put together right on the, on the scene. We, you'll see that the benches are just bolted down there. And the actual bolts to hold the benches in place are the bolts in the same location that the next unit will sit on. We, we built them that way with Eichenkopf design so that all that has to happen is the benches are removed and the new columbarium unit is set right on that concrete base. It's a very quick process, so it takes only one day. Well, I'll say that we've always had a very good working relationship with uh, Eikhoff. Eikhoff has just been great to work with and they're, they're always very responsive to any of our needs. It's a very good firm to work with.